It's gonna take all day and into the night to deal with that crazy woman fighting, conniving, clawing at each other. Are you angry or excited right now? I can't tell. Mrs. Donaghy and her lawyer are here. I'm sorry, John, I'm a little early. <laughs> this would work on Ugly Betty. There's two lines. <laughs> no, no, there's one line. We're in it. I'm just getting a hot dog. We're all getting hot dogs. What, well, you think there's two lines and we're all in this line? You're the only genius that got in the other line? <laughs> you believe this guy? Don't line up behind him. He cheated you. Hey, shut up. What do you want to do? I want all the hot dogs, please. No, no, yeah, no, you don't have I'm to buying do all the I'm hot right dogs. Hold on, please. You don't have to do that. You don't have to do that. I'm, I'm, I'm giving them to the good people. Oh, oh, I'm starving. Who's that kicking it down the street, causing a stir? Who's that? I know that you're wondering that's her. And how did you two meet? Mm, it was part of the Big Brother Little Sister program. <laughs> Congratulations, John. She's much sharper than the last girl you had. What was her name? Beyonce. Hmm. And unlike the rest of Jack's girlfriends, I have all my original parts. Oh, hang on to this one, John. She's a keeper. Mm, yeah, I'm a keeper. <laughs> so now it's a date? I thought I could never be your date, Jack. I thought no one would ever believe it because I'm so grotesque. Thank you for not embarrassing me. That looks fierce. Hey, Liz. Sari, seriously, take that off. And you, stop encouraging her. You're an enabler. You need to dress like you have a job. And parents who raised you in some kind of shame-based American religious tradition. Here. I can make this hot. Now I get to pick out what I think you'd look good in. Oh, I'm not really the fashion person. You're wearing this. <laughs> Come on, no. I'm serious. This color would be amazing on you, and you're a size four, right? <sighs> well, aren't you sweet? <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> what, are, <laughs> what are you wearing? You're making me gay. It's a joke, obviously. I'm wearing this as a joke. A bunch of comedy writers don't know a joke, jeez. I just threw up in my mouth. I said it's a joke! Guys. Hey, I hope I don't sweat on you. <laughs> you can sweat on me. This is my girlfriend, Liz Lemler. Hi! That's Liz Lemon. Oh, the girl who got my flowers. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed them. I did. Actually, I finally just threw them out this morning because they got that really bad flower smell. I, I kind of couldn't stop smelling them. <laughs> Advanced hip hop, you ready? Here we go. Here we go. Take it five, six, seven, eight, and one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Woo. Turn it. Don't give up, ponytail. You got this. No, 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 no. Are you kidding me? You eat too many hot dogs. Please, I am concerned. I copy this article on sodium for you. Fine, but I will be reporting this to the Fox Problem Solvers. Hey, are you gonna come sit down because they put out lobster tails? And I wanna eat yours. Isn't she beautiful? Yeah, what happened there? I just couldn't keep up with her. On any level. Socially, it was a different party, a different charity event every night. I had to keep my tuxedo in my glove compartment. Sexually, she wanted it four or five times a day, and always standing up. <laughs> standing up? What? How does that even work? You're kidding, right? Yeah. Tell me to calm down, you fung dark. Yeah, you're right. It doesn't work. Hey. Sorry I'm late. Well, thank God you're here. This place is creeping me out. I don't think I can do this. Oh, you're going to be great. They're cute. 
Do you think they're Wall Street guys? Yeah, I think they're from the firm of Date Rape, Cokington, Cheeseball, and Jag. <laughs> you got to give this a chance. Excuse me, is this seat taken? Oh, really, dude? I gotta move my coat? There's like four empty seats down there. Can't you just be cool? <sighs> that guy wanted to buy you a drink. Really? I already have a drink. Do you think you'd buy me mozzarella sticks? What is the matter with you? Oh, I don't know. I'm just nervous and rusty. Well, just relax and be yourself. Can I have a martini, please? Hi. Oh, he knows where Bin Laden is. Come on. The Carlisle Group, the Unical Pipeline, the assassination of Olaf Palm. Come on, the proof is in the pudding. Oh, these are good. Really? You think she looks like Jessica Simpson? You could put a long blonde wig on a ferret and it would look like Jessica Simpson. And by the way, Jessica Simpson would think that you are old and gross. So good luck with that. I really didn't think I was gonna meet anybody tonight, but you and I have so much in common. Also, you have really pretty eyes. Oh, hi. I learned the truth at 17. That love was meant for beauty queens. Hey, you're bumming us out. High school girls with clear skin smiles who married young and then retired. Whoa. I thought bars were open till 4. No, nope, 11.30. Let's get you to bed. I thought my sister couldn't even have a baby, so she's really excited. Oh, he's adorable. OK, we're at the bottom of page 2. Look, everybody, Sherlock Homo is here to solve the case of the gay sweater. I'm telling you guys, watching that isn't going to get us out of here any faster. OK, everybody, let's get started. Hi, my name is Floyd, and I'm an alcoholic. Hi, Floyd. Hi, Floyd. Uh, it's been four years since my last drink, but I just broke up with my girlfriend, so I guess today I'll be talking about my issues with women and trust. The dishonesty that my dad had. This apology thing is interesting. Oh, even when it's something normal, I hate going up to Jack's office. I always feel like I'm entering the Death Star. I expect to see stormtroopers. I'm telling you, if Donaghy does this at me, I will run. You'll be fine. Captain Nita. No, Captain Nita dies. He dies. You're not a big shot movie star anymore, Trey. You're the star of TGS, and you will read the lines as written starting tonight. Because this show is important. I set a very high standard for myself, and I expect the same of the professionals who work with me. When Abraham Lincoln gets hit in the crotch, can I go cross-eyed? Oh, yes, do that. That's hilarious. You're trying to avoid Jenna. She gave me a screener of her movie. And? Oh, Pete, it's awful. I couldn't believe how bad it was. Although I guess it's no surprise that Tony Hawk can't play blind. So you must know the title. Yes, yes, The Rural Juror. The ru Rural. The ru Rural. Ah. So what are you going to do about Jenna? Oh, same thing I've always done when she's in something terrible. Think of one thing nice to say and then hug her. So what did you think? Oh my god, you looked so beautiful. <sighs> The lighting was really neat. Uh, Ethan and I both thought the programs were really easy to read. So what nice thing are you going to say about the Roaring Junior? Oh, I don't know. It's a mess. Yeah, no, you've got to tell them that when Paris Hilton tries to make out with the bear, the bear has to act like he's into it. Right. Great news, great news. <laughs> Bianca is neither normal nor happy. You don't have to do this, Lemon. I'm telling you, she's not over you. And get this, she was all jealous of me. She busted out crying over it. That's impossible. Oh, fine. You don't believe me? I'm going to go over there. I'm going to tell her that you just proposed to me. And you watch her. Watch how red her face gets. Okay. Hi, Bianca. I I'm 
really sorry about what I did, and I know that you can't forgive me, but just to even things out, here is all of my weird secret stuff. I have been sexually rejected by not one, but two guys who later went to clown college. I get super nervous whenever I hear a vacuum cleaner because when I was a kid, my mom used to turn on the vacuum to drown out the sound of her and my dad fighting, which is why I rarely vacuum my apartment. Like, never. I have had three donuts so far today. Uh, once in college, I pooped my pants a little bit at a country steaks all you can eat buffet, and I didn't leave until I finished my second plate of shrimp. A couple of months ago, I went on a date with my cousin. Wow, I, I am a mess. There is an 80% chance in the next election that I will tell all my friends I am voting for Barack Obama, but I will secretly vote for John McCain. Here's one. Um, when I was a kid, I used to put on my fanciest nightgown, and then I would mix orange soda and cream soda in a champagne glass, and I would sit in the dark and watch The Love Boat. Consequently, I have some weird sexual fantasy stuff about Gopher from The Love Boat. Good, you're here. Josh and his agent are on their way up. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Then they're gonna be on their way down. Um, you know, that was weak, but you're in the mix. You're having fun. I like that. Gentlemen, make yourselves comfortable. What are all these headshots for? Nothing. Just some meetings we're taking. Meetings? And if... Look, Jack, I think I should tell you, Josh has an offer from The Daily Show. Yes, Liz mentioned that. I don't think that's gonna pan out. What, are you kidding? What happened? What'd you do to our offer? I called my friend Saul Scheinhardt at our parent company, Scheinhardt Wiggs, who called his nephew Morty Scheinhardt, who called his son, John Stewart. Ah, uh hi, -huh, you burnt. Let's get down to brass tacks. Josh can stay. Thank God. But no rays, no movies, and only one Jewish holiday. What's the one where they go into the tent? Sukkot. That's the one. You got a deal? Deal. Thank you. I need this money. I have a really bad sex addiction. Sorry. That's... That's it? I thought you said we could crush him. What are you talking about? I took away everything. That's a crushing. No, do more stuff. You made me look like an idiot. You have to pay. Liz, he's not getting a raise. Do the worm. Do the worm! Good lord, the worm! That's so degrading. Are its origins German? Uh, now say five reasons I'm better than you. You're smarter than me. One. You can beat me in arm wrestling. Two. Uh, you read the paper. Yeah, suck it. I do read the paper. Do you want me to do anything? Be a crab. crab. Fight the worm! <laughs> Liz, you took this like a natural more than I ever... Okay, now, the crab is getting aroused. Shut it down. Shut it down. What was that about? Just talking to my bud, Jack Donaghy. Bud? Really? Yes, he said he wants us to be friends. He gave me chameleon air tickets, and he even did this to me. Wow, well, look, having Jack on your side could only make life easier. It's good for everybody if he wants to be friends. I know, but it's so weird. It's like that scene where you see the back of Darth Vader's head with his helmet off, and you're like, oh, he's a human being. I gotta get some new DVDs. Did we just go in a circle? Yeah, I was following you. I was following you? No, I'm going to wardrobe. Okay, good walk and talk. What did you think of the movie? Oh my god, Jenna, the soundtrack was so moody. What else did you like about it? What? Oh, um, you were good. Your face was very expressive. And another cool part was the trees. I gotta get back to work. You didn't like the movie. What? Yes, I just said I liked the movie. Uh, no, you didn't. You did that condescending compliment thing you always do. What? When have I ever done that? So, what did you think? Oh, my God. You looked beautiful. <laughs> the lighting was really neat. Ethan and I both thought the programs were really easy to read. Well, that's not how I remember any of that. I would have a three-way with two jacks. You need to call it. Let's face it, at our age, we can't afford to waste any time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Floyd and I have been dating for a month. Do you think I should be mad that I don't have a ring? <laughs> well, how sex in the city are we right now? I'm Samantha, you're Charlotte, and you're the lady at home who watches it. We need to search your bag. Oh. Of course they do. You know, I dream about moving back to Lakewood, or maybe even Shaker Heights, Big Creek Parkway, sending the kids to St. John Bosco's, you know? 
Maybe even cheering on the tribe at the Jake. This dream, this is way down the road, right? Yeah. Yeah, three, maybe four years. What's this fungus screen for? All right, that's it. Show's over. Hey, that. Let's just walk. So how long do you see yourself living in New York? Well, like forever. At least I did. Really? You want to end up like that? No, I'm going to be like her. Oh, there is nothing like New York in the spring. It's oh! Ooh. <laughs>